total incorrect way to adjust the height. That's where it should to be the preload. And this is the correct way to adjust the height. Let the entry begin. Ladies and gentlemen, the countdown has just begun. Welcome back to another episode and thanks for your continuing support. Here, as you can see, this is a short video of how the universal coilover sleeve work installed on your car. Okay, let me explain here. My car is running at the lowest point. You can adjust this coilover sleeve. And this is why it is heating and making coil bind. And if you see the car up to the side, the car still have a little bit of um, wheel gap. So this is completely trash. Okay guys, now I'm going to show um, how look the coilover sleeve installed on the strut uh, outside of the car. I'm going to remove all the universal coilover sleeves along the strut to install later the full coilover suspension. If you wonder, I got the coilover suspension out of eBay. I'm gonna leave it in the description below a link to Amazon if you want to buy a set for your car. And, you, and if you use that link, you are helping my channel because I got a little commission out of any uh, sales. If you buy the coilovers or whatever from Amazon, you are helping me. Thanks for that. Also, um, I want to mention. I'm a little behind of schedule in the English version of each video because I have several issues on the real life. Um, one of them is the grandmother of my wife passed away and I'm having a lot of other issues so that's why I'm behind schedule on the English version. Remember, I need to erase all the voice uh, record on Spanish from each video to do a voiceover in English so take that under consideration and also I think I'm gonna separate this channel now because the majority of my subscribers are from Spanish people Spanish uh, speaking people so I'm gonna make a new channel to put all the English content there so check in the description below I'm gonna leave the link to the new channel so please go there and subscribe uh, to get only content in English thanks uh, for your time and your continuing support I'm gonna leave the, the video now so you can show me removing this universal color slips and in the next video, I'm going to do a install and how to set correctly the new full coilovers.
com a cura. Okay guys, here you have it, side by side, and the universal coil slip inserted on the stroke the right way because most people use the universal coilover slip with the lower um, coil support and that's, uh, that's completely wrong because you are going to have a, a big foot pretty much if you don't cut that part also I want to, to tell you guys uh, here this coilover is at the the most lower uh, you can go with it with the coilover and if you compare it to the to the comparison to the universal slip it's a huge difference um, I had to rise the new coilovers when installed because it was extremely low the car don't even don't even can be put down of the jack so you can go pretty low if you want now, now what i'm going to do next is uh, try to make both um, the new coilover and as long as the old coilover slip with strut so when I install everything back I have a starting point to you know to start adjusting the right height well guys I want to take this last second of the video to thank everyone again to be part of my channel the, for the time you you spend uh, viewing my videos for the patient you have with me because I don't speak well English and also for the support if you share my videos if you subscribe if you leave a like or dislike if you don't like the video of course um, everything else you do that's helping me because uh, making YouTube video means a lot to me I really want to be a youtuber in a future in the future and I hope one day I can achieve that thanks again for everyone to that and please be part of my channel consider to subscribe like the video and share with your friends thanks a lot for that guys Well guys, as always, get your hands dirty and make it happen. We'll see you in the next video. Bye.